Hello and welcome back to the last remnant. Today is base number four, and if that doesn't take very long, base number five as well, but considering the previous base, I'm not so sure about things anymore. The outsides are easy enough, even when there's a ton of stuff like there is right now. Uh, the outside is easy enough to deal with. You can't target anyone at range, you piece of crap. Basically, nobody can. I'm gonna keep everyone more or less moving south here. Try and keep my dudes in a group, try and keep their dudes in a group, you know the deal. These groups are so small, too. I think the biggest group we've seen outside of the bases was three or something, which is ridiculously small compared to other stuff we've been Just fighting. Like that. I suppose it makes them much more resilient against AoEs, because there's two of them, but they still have like 10,000 health, so... Whereas we have to have a billion people to have 3,000 health. At least until I start hitting crazy high battle ranks. I hate these half-baked mutants! Yes! Yeah, everybody's getting hyped! Apparently everybody is getting hyped. Just in case you are unaware, everyone's getting hyped. Ow. Whoops. And then she dodged. We have we have crazy dodge and uh, block chances lately. I don't know why. Also, I was hoping Pegasus would ask for his item when we came out of that castle, but he did not. I could have gone and done some random encounters and then gone back to the whole map and he would have asked for it, but... Eh. We'll just keep at it with this here. The bridge is lowered. I don't understand how those bridges work, but whatever. Attack them from their flank. Apparently we should attack them from- oh, they spawned right next to us. Oh no, this is a- never mind. We should knock them over. Did they spawn right next to us? No, I don't know where they spawned. This dude spawned right next to us, or we happened to wander over to him. I'm not sure at this point, actually. We're just going to keep gaming, ganging up on single units here, apparently, because that's how that works. Until the boss spawns, and then we'll game up on him, because he's the boss, and he triggers the end of it. Although, if we killed everyone on the map, we would probably get more, uh... Excuse me, more restorative items at the end of the battle. Oops, that doesn't matter, but whoops, nonetheless. They've been reinforced again! Once again, the bridge right next to us. We haven't even moved from, like, the spawn, the starting area of this fight very much. Oh. Daddy there. You can't spawn and do a freaking smoke canister. That's not how this works. So two groups march towards us. You would like to do something. You would like to do the Gable. They're probably going to get intercepted, though. How did you get over here? Rush, where are you? Well, you're right here, I'm aware, but... How... How did you do this? Who's wanna step up? They're gonna get knocked down. I don't understand how he got over there. Either way, let's try and support uh, Dave here. David, so he can get Gabolg off without getting raid locked. If he gets interfered, that sucks because Gabolg would end everyone's life here, which is quite nice. Speeds the whole process up. Rush's group is Rush's group, and they continue to murder things willy nilly, so. Fine by me, everyone and their mother knows Cutting Lunge 5. Literally everyone. You only hit one person again. And then you got flight. Well done. They're gonna die. Ooh, not quite. Very close to it, but not quite. Of course, by the time freaking David actually gets his turn, everything's going to be dead anyway. I hope they reinforce before he acts. Nice block. If we get a reinforce before his turn, that'll be really sweet. Oh, I didn't even kill that group. Oh well. Gabold, I call upon thee. 
kind of a waste of a gay bulg. There's only two unions that are even remotely competent. And those aren't necessarily very competent, but whatever. And then watch it spawn like seven unions right after this. That would be unfortuitous. Hello. Have an artillery fire. That does so much damage, it's funny. Reinforced with how many is the question? A lot. See, this is what I wouldn't wanted the Gable to shoot for, is that, but whatever. That would have been so much better, but whatever. You guys really need to heal. If you can target someone, kill them. If you can't heal, you guys need to heal as well. We're counting on May you. as well get our heals off while we're over here outside of their attack range so we don't have any risk of being raid locked or anything. Although I don't know necessarily that that revitalize was actually needed, but whatever. They could have used a revitalize. They don't have a revitalize though. Hello, sir. Please die. Well, good enough. They'll die soon, I guess. Maybe. Maledict will kill him, though. Maybe, actually. I thought poison was going to do more than that. I wish everyone had Maledict. That'd be great. It killed him anyway. Maledict is the greatest skill. Alright, so keep your HP up. Why not? Close in. Murder them. Close in, close in. That'll do. Rush is still way off by himself, and I think I told him to move in towards a, uh... I think I told him to move in towards the enemy unions that are way off by themselves as well. Which is a bit stupid of me, but whatever. Given how these fights generally go, even if I screw up, there's not too much going on here. It's just a lot of dudes. Now if they all if all of the units collectively fought me at the same time, these fights would be crazy difficult. Although caustic blasts and gay bulgs would be extraordinarily powerful in that instance, but whatever. Oh they've been reinforced again. Didn't occur to me that the boss hadn't spawned. How many more? Just the one? Nope, he brought friends. Again, Gable would be nice. There's the boss. He's kind of... He's in there, though. Can we get a caustic? No. Play it by ear. Like you, get in my way. What do you want to murder? You want to use Blackout. It's highly unlikely he's going to be able to get that off, but sure. We will allow his opportunity there. I don't know who's attacking who at this point, but whatever. Pegasus is weird. It's got great skills. It's a weird dude, though. Hey, he did actually use Blackout. Nice. Rip a lot of people. Yep, rip everybody. Good lord. I hope I've grown stronger than before. Mystic stuff, Sweet. huh? A new power. That means nothing Guess to I'm me. not seen out quite I yet. I feel like I've grown. Everyone talks at the same time. I was not expecting Blackout to just straight up finish the fight. That's ridiculous. I know it's powerful. There's more. There's way more powerful stuff beyond Blackout, but I wasn't expecting it to just end. I don't. He didn't kill the boss, did he? The boss was still alive. There appears to be two of them over there. I don't know why I'm saving it. Auto saves right at the door. That's a bit stupid of me, but whatever. There appears to be two of them over there, so let's go have a gander and see what's wrong with these two. What the hell took you so long? Ugh. I'm gonna bust you up extra just for making me wait. Hannah, don't get too cocky. Hannah, just stand back. I won't even need your help with these punks. Don't be silly. Do you think I'd allow them the chance to hurt you? 
Okay. For you, I can share. The grief bringers bring in lots of pain your way! As am I, the merciless! Alrighty then. Fair enough. Defeat Hannah and Hina. They appear to be split into groups of two. That makes sense, I suppose. Uh, Caustic Blast for me. We want one union apiece. Preferably not Rush, but it's probably going to end up being Rush. Unless we can swing it our way here. I'd like Caustic Blast if possible. Uh, preferably one union per boss here, and preferably the two tanky unions that we have. Everyone else will start picking on the support guys. You know the drill. Except this time we have more people to deal with. Why are you so bad? Play by ear. Still haven't truly op- oh. Oh. They- oh. I forgot about this. Forgot about that ability? Uh, seems like they're gonna probably end up doing that every turn too. Nice dodge. 12k free damage is really good. Sucks that she dodged that and it hit nobody else too. Hmm. Can't poison them. Figured as much. And we were intercepted. I knew that would happen. Kinda sucks who got intercepted considering they've been injured already, but whatever. I can break them off, actually, since they're multi-deadlocked already. With someone who has Orphic Ward, hooray! I doubt that'll help in this fight, unless Twin Snow Petal counts as magic, which I doubt it does. Please kill everyone. No! Good enough! I'll... I'll... that's... that's good enough. Shield Potion? Oh. That's a pretty good potion. Did Twin... oh, Twin Snow Petal hit everybody? I should have figured that much, but I didn't think it did. That was... It is called Silent Gas, but that was a very anti-dramatic death. They might be in trouble. Ooh, why do I do that every time? Alright, so, they're down to two support unions. I wish you guys to keep your health up. I wish you guys to also keep your health up, but I'm more... Uh, they have so little health, though. And these all break... Well, no, they just don't know what to do. Whatever, we'll, we'll do it that way. Play by ear. You guys... Move. But I guess you guys can attack them too, why not? Lots of people playing it by ear. They'll heal if need be and they have the opportunity to. We gotta keep our health up because they're doing a lot of defense down and stuff. Considering they have... They know Twin Snow Petal, which is an amazing powerful ability if you didn't notice. This sucks. Considering they know that, I gotta be careful about the defense downs. You think we'd know Restore 5 by now, but whatever. It's alright. I don't know which of these two- whoops, I totally hit Y, but whatever. I don't know which of these two is more dangerous. We've gotten counters on both of them so far. Which I assume is going to make this a bit faster. That, however, is going to slow it down a wee bit. Do they s they still have two support unions, right? And they're both basically full health now, aren't they? Yep, they are. And there's people deadlocked with both of them, so there will be no reviving. Keep playing it by ear for now. It's the best we're gonna get out of people at the moment is play it by ear, I guess. Oops. I need to pay more attention to my crit triggers. Clearly. Neither of the sisters are in crit. Which is unfortuitous. 
everything in this game is unfortuitous, I'm gonna be honest. So I hate reassess, but he didn't, so whatever. Thankfully the sisters seem to primarily be doing defense down or basic attacks. Which are really easy to survive. These, un these uh, support unions though, they're putting up a hassle here. Putting up a fight. I wish they would stop, but they are. Um... Then you go for the kill, lower their morale, that'll be helpful. And for some reason, you guys... You're deadlocked, but you just... You don't want to do anything but attack, for some reason. Oh. That's bad. That's really bad. That's like multiple levels deep of bad. Are you even trying? Not bad. Probably gonna end up losing this fight now. Our morale is way low. Our morale is gonna go up a bit, but mm, it doesn't matter considering we have people so close to dead. And we're gonna have more people dead here, because they're yeah they're not killing that union. So we have two dead, and the other two are in deadlock. I'm pretty sure this is a lost fight. These freaking... Look at the bollocks coming off of these unions. It's bollocks, I say. Absolute bollocks. We're gonna try and revive people, but... I don't know. I don't know about Wait, this. Somebody took me out? Thank you for the revitalize, actually. I was about to ask if no one else was it capable of healing, because that would have been bad. We're gonna get raid locks like crazy here. Which may end up just getting people killed again, because the morale is gonna be so low. Please heal? Oh lord. Raid lock one! Raid lock two! And no morale, which means everything they do is going to murder us. Yeah, that union's dead. Ooh, not quite. This union, however... Mm, looking pretty low. Oh, there it is. I was getting a bit over-exaggerating there. Uh, you guys need to heal. Badly. If you heal, you're gonna deadlock again. I would like you to heal in combat if possible, but... You guys try and bring them back, because you're the only one not currently deadlocked, even though they should be. We're gonna get killed. Ooh, please heal. Heal. Thank you. For the love of God, man, heal. For the love of God, man, heal as well. Counter? Nice. Oh, it didn't kill him, though. Maybe this guy will. There we go. Thankfully, finally, both of the support unions are dead. We still have to deal with Hina, Hina and Hannah. Hina and Hannah? I think it's Hannah. I can't remember. They're strong. You're not wrong. They're not even in crit yet. I might be pushing my battle rank way too hard at this point. Thank you for provoking. That was the one attack I wanted them to do. So we need to get our health back. Also, people need to revive. Get our morale back as well. You guys aren't deadlocked, so... Bring them back, turn it around, turn it around. Get some damage out there. Oh, well, maybe I should have got some heals out there because we have no morale. Uh, fight's over. I know, I said it. I called it before it even happened. Called it, it was over. That was some bollocks and a half right there. I think I'm pushing my battle rank too hard. Mayhaps, if we can manage to finish this base, I will go ahead and do some stat grinding for a little bit before we continue on with the next bases. I desperately need more HP. And I think the easiest way to get that is going to be accessories, and I... I don't have the accessories to do that. 
I would still like to do the same general plan here. Maybe we should try to focus one down, that'll take out their ability to do... Twin... what's its face? Twin snow pedal. I think we might try and do that. We're gonna bunch everyone up over here and probably get interfered for it as well, but... we we'll bunch everyone up over there and try and get one of the sisters down as quickly as physically possible. Because otherwise, they're gonna do this all the time. Ow. We might actually lose unions anyway, because... stuff like that happens, and I don't think I have anyone healing. Seriously? How did both sisters intercept someone? There's no way both sisters should have been intercepting people. At least not that quickly. We shall stop them here. So one's down, both sisters are deadlocked again, which is exactly what I didn't want. Except they deadlocked this time via, whoops, via freaking interceptions. Which is some bollocks. If we get Maledict up quickly on this fight, it'll be alright, which we did. That may end up killing them, it'll give us a ton of morale as well. There we go. Hooray! How did we multi-deadlock her? And now you're paralyzed. Well done! And now you're dead! Well done! Well done. You don't say well done to yourself, you doggle. That's not how this works. This fight's going way worse than last time. I should've yeah. stuck with that plan. In fact, it looks like we're gonna very quickly stick with the last plan because this union's already or this fight's already over. I think they're the only one left. No, I got two left. Is there like a re soft reset? There is a soft reset. Hooray! Soft resets. I'm gonna give this fight one more try. On camera, one more try anyway. And then there's gonna be some editing involved, and maybe some grinding. I don't care about your bollocks, Hina and Hannah. Alright. How are we gonna make this better? I have no idea. I also have a very sniffly nose, I apologize. Well clearly we may as well just deadlock both sisters, there's not really much getting around that. We'll try and caustic blast it. We'll have Rush's group grab her, we'll have you two grab these two even though you're bad at it. I guess you grab that one. Sure, whatever, I don't know. You won't get forgiveness from me. Oh yeah, I really should have someone set up the field on the first turn to heal. I keep forgetting about that little tidbit of information. How did you intercept someone? Thank you. That's not... no. <laughs> I had my first two unions attacking the sisters and both of them intercepted. Which means this first turn was literally a waste of time. Damn it! We shall stop them here. here I say it it's a waste of time, by the way, because the unions who were meant to attack the sisters, they're coming second, and the unions that were meant to AOE down the other guys coming first, and it's all sorts of bollocks up. So now we got multi deadlocks when I didn't want multi deadlocks. Get him next time. Can't black out the sisters, by the way. I don't think you can black out any boss, and many of the rares I think are immune to it. That means all of these support groups are just gonna have free reign to flank people. Which is very rapidly going to screw us over.
Unless we dodge all their attacks. I do still have a sniffly nose, I apologize. I don't know if you guys can hear it, I assume you can. At least they don't have attack up potions, although the freaking defense potions are bad enough. Look at this bollocks. Did every one of them attack the same union? So one dead, many wounded. David is supposed to be tanking. As is Rush. But he wants to do Talisman's Gift, apparently. For some reason. I don't know why, but because he wants to, sure. Oh, lordy lordy. He has played by ear. We need to revive that person, but again, you know the deal, we can't really necessarily revive people very well when we have a bunch of extra unions running around. We need to get our HP up though before they decide to twin snow petal us again. Or at least kill one of them before they decide to twin snow petal us again. What would help tremendously is if we could manage to freaking kill some of these support groups at some point in this fight. Our lack of morale does not help that, I can tell you that right now. Which sucks, I'm sure you're aware, but whatever. At least he went first, so Talisman's Gift isn't useless. It's almost useless, but not quite. We're burning through so many restorative items, and we're barely hurting anything. And they're flanking us with a double caustic blast, which means we're dead. So, two unions dead. Tons of support unions still running around. I can't revive, we're all deadlocks. This cannot be done. I'm gonna break deadlock with her and see if they can manage to get over there in time. Well, there's Talisman's Gift saving us from some damage, as that union fails to do anything useful. Dang it. Well, at least they killed it. That's The downside is Bluff doesn't trigger if the union's dead, because it has to have a target. So we didn't get our morale out of that. And we're gonna get raid locked probably a lot. So much so that that unit is probably going to die, thus making the revive completely useless. Ooh. I guess that doesn't matter, because they don't have much attack to begin with. What does matter, though, is the fact that Oak's friends is dead. Isn't over yet. See, the thing is, once we get low morale like this, it just... We can't turn it around, because we can't kill any of these unions. sucks pretty badly uh sure bring them back i'm sure that'll go well oh good twin snow pedal at zero morale i think i'm gonna have to do some grinding because it doesn't look like we can very easily if at all do this fight and when i say grinding i mean stat grinding not level grinding i would like to not level grind if physically possible Rush is dead. Okay, never mind. Ooh, that's bad news bears. So we lost. Well fought. Well fought indeed, I suppose. Ah. Keep at it, alright? I don't know if we should, Paris. I don't know if we should. We're never gonna have more than zero morale. It's not happening right now. And she keeps casting support, which is interesting. They have an interesting support that casts on both of them, which is cool. Bring them back. Bring them back. Bring everybody back and then get raid logs and die to like blackout or something. I didn't realize they could cast blackout. It turns out they can. It turns out I wish they couldn't. We desperately need morale. Well, there's Raidlock. 
which means we only got one revive off, and both of the other unions will probably get raid locked as well. Uh, lordy lordy. That mage group needs to die. Look at their mages! Look how much damage they're doing. Curses. Let's see. That's Hannah. Frankly... And that's Henna. Frankly, I'd rather have those two try and revive and maybe this group try to do something here, but they don't have any attacks, apparently. I don't know what it is with Cademan's Cademan's group most of the time, but he just doesn't want to use his abilities. Which is annoying. Literally. It's, a bit, it's a bit overkill on the revitalize thing. We have so much AP, we just can't use it because we're busy reviving. Arg. If we can get our morale back to half and kill that support group, I, whoops, I think we'll be all right. It would have helped if I had not screwed that up. I can tell you that much. Oh, we got another one. Not that you know matters if they're paralyzed because they're casting wind shear, which will kill that union anyway. They dodged, I guess. Thank you for using Provoke instead of something more useful. I appreciate it. I wish you had done the same, but you did not. So everyone's alive. I want you to kill that group. Like, now. your status ailments, keep your HP up, keep your HP up, uh, hang in there. They're probably gonna end up dying because of the hang- uh, well, they're gonna end up dying anyway. I was gonna say because I hang in there. This is gonna kill three unions again. No, just two, but that's two too many. Oh, balls. My hand wasn't on the controller. I don't know how many more vivification herbs we can actually make. And considering these two, neither of them technically are in critical, I don't know if it matters. Thank you. Are you okay? Hmm. If we can but just kill this group and get our freaking morale up, that would be it. Please don't die, David. You're my only hope for killing this really union. It? Thank you. Can you heal? No, you're not gonna heal. You will, however, get flanked. Oh, that's Veronica, never mind. Casting support again. These two make a very good and effective pair, and I wish they did not. You guys revive, you guys revive. Keep your HP up. I guess, I don't know. They shouldn't twin the snow petal us because they just did it. Does Provoke stack, I wonder? I would do wish they'd stop flanking Veronica, but at least Veronica's living. But I wonder if Provoke stacks, and that's why they keep casting it constantly. Was I really dead? Yes, you were, in fact. You're not the only one who's died today. This is a very expensive fight. You might have been able to tell. Hey, support. Maybe that'll help a little bit. I kind of doubt it, but maybe. I don't know. They're gonna cast it again. I wonder if support stacks, because if it does, well, balls. Alright, so. Let's get David's group on her, and everyone else needs to go beat the crap out of the other sister. I'll have you guys play it by ear. Yeah, I'll have them play it by ear. Hopefully we can at least get her to critical. It's ridiculous that we've not even seen critical yet. And there's two of them. Yeah, flanked again. Silence? Ooh. All she did was attack and it caused silence. Interesting. 
That was a very guttural roar. Alright, so everyone else should be doing damage to her. Preferably a lot of damage to her. Currently, that's not occurring. That's a bit better, but not nearly enough. And she caused Paralyze. Okay, they cause status ailments by hitting you. That's not good, if you couldn't tell by the sound of my voice. We could... How is that too fast? We could use some heals, by the way, game. Not dodges, heals. Although dodges on our side would be nice. Play it by ear... Set you to recover, turn it around, hang in there. Actually, I'm going to set them to straight up recover. We might end up dying anyway, because it's how this game functions, and they'll probably do twin snow pedal. Yeah. <sighs> All we need to do is kill one. Which apparently is very hard, so maybe I should stop saying all we need to do. She dodged almost all of those. Ooh, that was close. Hey, critical! They did quite a lot of damage there. We need heals to go out, though. Badly. On everybody. And for some reason they didn't heal, I thought I told them to. Not rush, they're healing, obviously. Maybe some heals out on our tank groups is what I meant. Perhaps you guys... Hey, there you go. I was going to say, perhaps they could get some good damage or a heal out. They've opted for the heal. Not much of one, but whatever. David, you are tanking. Tank. Rush, you are not tanking. Revive them. I don't know how much that's going to do, but we're going to try it, darn it. Because she needs to die if I am to win this. This is such an expensive fight. How many herbs did we go through? Uh... Excuse me? Excuse me? Excuse me. Fuck this. So you're telling me... She can heal her sister to full health. You... Who designed this fight? At least our morale's getting up. Maybe we can start tanking snow petals without melting. But seriously? 90,000 heal? Does anyone need heals? Yeah. I'm a little exasperated, don't mind me, it's alright. Everything's fine, we got it under control, our morale is starting to increase, everyone's alive. We just need to get people healed so they stop dying. And then we can survive twin snow petals, hopefully, if we get our morale high enough. Which, if we keep flanking and using bluff, we can fairly easily. This fight, man. This fight. This endurance fight and a half going on right here. We got lots of support coming out from Rush, though, so that's good. I like Moonset. We need to use Moonset more often. We need to do a lot of high tier abilities more often, but that was remarkably close to death. Be careful. And now they're not remarkably close to death. I think everyone's healed, mostly. Yeah, for the most part. Uh, you guys keep playing it by ear.
or what I want them to do. Do that, I guess. Uh, give it all you've got. Play it by ear. Give it all you've got. Hopefully we can burn her down. Oh, there's twin snow petals. Wondering when that was going to trigger. Hopefully we can burn her down quickly again. And hopefully... She misses. She didn't. Hopefully... Uh, she doesn't get a second chance again, or a third chance in this case. The fact that someone died sucks, by the way, because... Forget how to block? Yeah, did you forget how to block? Ow. We have such little health right now. If they do anything remotely AoE, we're screwed. If they do anything remotely, we're screwed. One of the sisters, I believe, is not deadlocked anymore, either. Well, now, no, no, that's, never mind. We're fighting Hina, Hina, the loudmouth, talkative one. Aww. All right, she's in critical again. Is she gonna get another second chance? Yes. I... So do we need to kill Hannah first, then? Don't, I don't know. I don't know. She's too far away, apparently. How did she heal then? I don't know. I don't understand what's going on here. Do I need to get them both to critical at the same time? Is that what I need? If possible, I'm gonna try and swap targets to Hannah. Instead of Hina, Hina, Hannah, whatever the balls her name is. This fight? I don't know if it's ever gonna finish. We might just be perpetually in here until we run out of Vivication Herbs. Ready at Raid Lux? Yeah. Figured as much. She did like no damage though. Because we actually have at least some morale, which is the important part here. heal off of the vitalize is ridiculous. Alright, everyone's back alive. Everyone more or less has health. Can we swap to Hannah? Can you do abilities that don't suck? Now, you guys need to tank her. Someone needs to tank her. So everyone should be on Hannah. Everyone appears to be on Hannah, except for that one union, which is how it should be. All right, round 65. At least Malady will get us some morale back, I believe. A very, very tiny bit, apparently. Oh. At least we know with everyone focusing, we can get them down into critical in just like a couple of turns without too much risk. Because most- they seem to only do special attacks outside of deadlock. Outside of norm normal turn rotation, I should say. She's already in critical. What special do we get? Or do we have to kill them before the end of the turn? Because if so, that's stupid. Because I don't know if you physically can kill them before the end of the turn. If she heals, I'm just gonna... I'm basically gonna rage quit. Ah, oh, that was the wrong button. My bad, my bad. She must be so close to dead. She did not get a heal, so only Hannah can heal then. Okay, should have done this way earlier, but how am I supposed to know? You actually only strike her. It's gonna seem a bit stupid, but I don't feel like we're probably going to need him over there. Having said that, I have no idea. Hold still so I can tear you apart. I wish we could get max morale to do some more damage here, but I don't think we'll ever be able to do that. You guys are so close to dead. Please kill her. If this unit killed her, that'd make me real happy. Hey, nice. 
All right. Yeah, and then she just fell over backwards. Fair enough. Caustic Blast is a bit useless for me. Anyway. It looks like we are going to be able to win this because without her sister, she can't do Twin Snow Petal. Now I have no idea what she does without her sister. It could be worse. So we'll have to be careful here. She made us go into a rage and murder everybody. How am I supposed to know? Well, watch. This one's gonna knock you into next week. She's still here, Rush. Or is next week now? I don't know. Hey, Max Morale, it happened. We did it, guys. We did it, Reddit. Not that Reddit cares in the slightest about anything I do. And she's in critical. What's she gonna do? Nothing. It is within our grasp, actually. I am very pleased to actually agree with you there. I am happy. This, this pleases me greatly. Oh, yeah, she does go into a rage. So this is what happens when overdrive triggers. We've seen it before. We basically got a free 20k damage out of that, which is amazing. Hooray! I hope I've grown stronger than before. Yay! That means nothing to me. Yay! See that? I feel like I've grown. I hope to put this power to great use. <laughs> I liked Arena. Yay! Great! Uh, apparently she's opted to immediately take the Night Bloom. Holy crap! I quite clearly need a better weapon, because look at the crap everyone else is getting. They're all getting remnants. I don't have a remnant. I did get... Well, I only got one for Hina. That sucks, but whatever. I wonder why uh, Pegasus didn't immediately take his, considering it was Pegasus specific, but whatever. Unless it's already equipped on him, I don't know, he didn't bring it up. Alrighty. That was an adventure! Oh, well, there you go. Necro Dragon Bone stuff. Sure. Everyone needs things, so do I. Get in line. Banshee's Octagon? What the heck is a Banshee's Octagon? What's well, an Octagon? I know that much. Let's go before I end this horrible video that I'll never speak of again. Let's go see if the Duke of Gore wants to speak to us. He does not. He cares not for what just occurred. Fair enough, I don't care for what just occurred either, and I was there. Either way, that was that. I'm gonna go curl up in the corner and uh, cry. In the meantime, thanks for watching, I'll see you guys next time.